going on YouTube. So uh, this is my first real day in uh, in Chicago. Well, I drove up here yesterday, but I don't really count that. I did drive around and I was looking for houses and stuff, but this is like my first real day out here. I dropped my mom off at the airport. We did a 13, 13 hour drive, guys, 13 hours. So here we are at a Hyatt Regency. That's where I'm staying at. First impressions of Chicago is that the demographics are a lot different than Korea. <laughs> It is, it is what it is, so um, we're going to take it day by day and uh, really try and uh, figure this thing out, you know. My first objective is to find a place to live. I looked at some places yesterday, but man, it's expensive in this city, man. It's expensive. Yo, somebody should have warned me it was going to be this expensive, but uh, we'll find it out. We'll see, we'll see what's going on, and then uh, maybe I'll give you guys a room tour, a hotel room. It's really cheap, man. Only paid like 89 bucks for it. 89 bucks a night. 89 bucks a night. I'm about to head inside. Just got some, I got some coffee from Dunkin' Donuts, man. Not taste good, man. This coffee does not taste good, man. I put four sugar packets in it. I had to put some steroids in it. <laughs> Help it taste a little bit better, but it still tastes like. Mm. And you know what I'm saying? It, it tastes bad. It tastes so bad. But yeah. So YouTube, what I'm doing right now is I'm going to be looking at houses. I've been I've been calling since yesterday, trying to trying to look at places, but Chicago is so expensive. It is so expensive. A few moments later. All right, YouTube, it's about 12:30, and I've called almost seven places. I'm gonna go to one more showing today, and we might have two. I'm trying to get a nice little two bed two bath above a thousand square feet that's not super expensive but we'll see what's going on i have some showings today and tomorrow oh i'm gonna go see a one bedroom one bath today and you guys will see that but i think right now i might go get some food i can't leave this place without my fucking keys though car trying to figure out exactly where I'm gonna go eat at um, I probably should go to Walmart too and grab some water but I don't think I'm gonna do that because I'm too lazy I might go grab by, I might go by Walmart when I'm going to my first viewing I'm gonna go or my fifth viewing because this is my first day in Chicago but yesterday I did go and look at some places and I will drop that in here and so you guys can see like a quick view of one of the places that I might stay in. I'm gonna go look for some food right now and we're gonna see where we're gonna go. So I'm sitting here, I'm trying to rent an apartment here. 
a condo or a townhouse, but like all of them are just so expensive. And I'm about to head out, I'm about to go to another showing. I don't really know if I wanna get this place, but I need to know what 800 and something square feet looks like. So that's the main reason why I'm gonna go see this one place right now. But like, this is crazy. One place charging me $70 just to go look at it. Like I have to fill out an application just to go view it. And I, I can't do that. I, I can't, I can't. It doesn't make sense to me because you have, you have too much of my, my private information if I don't even like the place. My social security number, you got my pace to where I work. You just, you have too much information, too much information for me. Uh, but all in all, it's just been a really weird renting experience uh, here in, uh, here in Chicago. Too. That's that's good. Mm -hmm. So I'm just now getting back in my car from seeing this one apartment complex. I stopped by 7-Eleven and I grabbed a Slurpee. But um, man, it's expensive. This is the one place. They have stuff open, but it's it's expensive. Like it's it's very expensive. Um, I I wouldn't even know if I wanted to live here. I, I'm trying to understand why people choose to to live in some of these more expensive places, rather than just get a a house that's got utilities paid for. <laughs> All right, YouTube, so I'm, I'm back. This is the last part of my uh, first day of Chicago. And I'm not counting yesterday, I'm not counting yesterday. Today's my uh, first full day in Chicago. And I spent it driving around, looking at apartment buildings, waiting for phone calls, trying to find somewhere to live. It, it's, it's definitely been an experience. It's, it's been a pretty big experience. I'm trying to save money. The biggest thing is I'm trying to save money in Chicago. Like that is that is the thing, I'm trying to save money. I'm not gonna be able to save that much money because it's just so damn expensive. But that's it. Um, tomorrow I'm gonna hopefully head back out, see some other places. I'm out. Y'all take it easy while, I, while this, this, this hurricane don't knock me over. Later.